Pisces, what's goody boo? It's your girl Blue and I'm comfortable today. I hope that you are as well. <laughs> I hope that you are in good spirits, feeling wonderful. And if you are not, it is my intention that you will be by the end of this reading. So come on in, my loves. Give your girl a big old hug. I missed you. Hey, Pisces. <laughs> Don't forget to hit that like button, exchange some energies with me. All right. And if you're new here, hello, my love. Welcome home. We so glad you kind of made it to the house. Okay. Don't forget to visit the subscribe button. Make sure you turn your notifications on so you don't get lost out here in these YouTube streets. All right. All right. So let's get it. Pisces, baby. When I tell you, I'm going to need for you to stay focused. You are headed. You got big shit popping. I'm going to say that. You got big shit popping, but there are forces and energies that want to slow you down, okay? These things could be people, places, things. It could even be subconscious, okay? Like things that you may not even be aware of that, I don't know, I feel like you're aware of this. For one, Pisces, I have a, a pre-shuffle out here, pre-spread, really, kind of like a, a half of a Celtic cross kind of or whatever. So in the you position, you got the chariot here. You're moving forward, right? You got your eye on the prize. You ready to get it. You understand what I'm saying? You taking the steps to get there. It ain't easy. You know what I'm saying? In the original tarot deck, the chariot is being pulled by two damn sphinx looking dogs that's on their stomach. They're not even moving. And then the chariot is a big ass brick of stone or some shit in the original tarot deck. But it's not an easy journey, but you get in there. You know what I'm saying? Your goal oriented. Okay. And you're going to get the what is crossing you in the Celtic cross is the five of cups though. All right. So there is definitely because here in the possible near future part of this, you have the queen of cups with the two of pentacles. You are going to gain. Um, I feel like it's something with your emotions. Okay. The five of cups is like crying over spilled milk. All right. You could even be um, um, in healing from past events. Right. Even things that happened years ago that, like I said in the beginning, like subconscious things, you know what I'm saying? I feel like you're getting through this, though. All right. You have the nine of cups. Right. OK. The nine of cups at the bottom and the hangman up top. I feel very much like a lot of you Pisces are taking the time out and the time needed to look at things from different perspectives for one. Also seeing the bigger picture of something. I feel like the Pisces I'm picking up on is not an a, a energy of victim consciousness. I feel like you are very much aware of why certain things happen, what you need to do to get over them, the things that you are aware of, okay? And I feel like somebody here has been really diligent in working on themselves, okay? So this could be getting over the loss of something in the past, all right? Or this could be, I'm getting very much like emotions. You know what I'm saying? Like getting, understanding your emotions. Getting, this is a lot of water, okay? And pinnacles too. A lot of water, a lot of earth, okay? So you could be practicing grounding right now, okay? Meditation, getting out in nature and things like that, right? All right, but I do feel as though with this five of wands on the bottom of the deck and the queen of cups with the two of pentacles right here, I feel like a inner battle is being overcome or something like that, okay? All right, this nine of cups, I'm loving it, all right? And then the seven of pentacles, you've been working towards your wish fulfillment. You've been working towards your wish fulfillment. This is something that I feel like drives you even when you're tired. You know what I'm saying? Like somebody here is determined. Okay. All right. The seven of pentacles here. All right, spirit. So what can Pisces look forward to? Excuse me. Energies here, spirit. It's like uh, one piece. It's like one piece is missing here. I don't know what that piece is. Peace? Is it peace? Is it peace? Is it peace? Something needs to calm the fuck down. Is that what I heard? Interesting. Give me a second. One piece is missing. Yeah, and that go to nine of wands. That's like the last leg of the race. Like one thing before you get to that ten of wands and you're done. All right, spirit. So what does what does Pisces need right now? What's this one piece? Some of, okay, yeah, the King of Swords. What do they need to see? Queen of Pentacles. Interesting. Oh Lord. 
first of all, it's something here about consistency, like consistently working on something. Okay. All right. I'm telling you the devil. Oh, he looks so disgusting today for some reason. <laughs> like extra black in the background. I don't know if y'all saw them lights flash back there, but they just flash. Okay. I don't know. He looks extra gross. Okay. But it's like, like, How do I say this? I feel like I'm talking to a light being, okay? Somebody of the light. You try to focus on the positive things in life. You try to give love to others and help other people as best you can. And I feel like your light irritates demons, okay? This thing that you're going towards, tell me about this This thing that Pisces is going towards. What I was going to say, though, is that, um, oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. You're going towards the sun. I like that. Two of Wands and the Page of Pentacles in the first beginning stages of something here. I feel like it's going to be a nine of, of cups, right? But I feel like it's not going to be just for you. Like, I feel like this is going to, like, your, you accomplishing something is going to help other people too or something like that. All right. This could even be just helping the people that's near you, like your family or something of that nature. The enemy is going to come. You know what I'm saying? He's going to try to throw you off. Especially when you're trying to do something different. You're trying to break generational curses. You're trying to get a new mindset. You're trying to clear out old energy. And then it's Mercury retrograde. So just be aware. Okay? Low vibration. It's just out of nowhere. You might just feel like, shit. You know what I'm saying? Recognize that ninja and put him in check. Period. Okay? All right? Because you got the Knight of Wands and the Five of Wands here. And it's kind of like giving me an energy of inconsistency and some sort of creative process okay but you're learning how to do something though you're lear like it's something it's you so what's the hangman tell me about that first y'all when i say this mug is seriously trying it's best to slow you the fuck down. What's the devil? I'm telling you, bruh, the three of wands, like this ninja is trying to put a hole in your boat that's about to come to show. Nah. This thing wants you to be waiting on your ships to come in for forever. It just wants you to be in fucking limbo. We rebuke you, Satan. Okay, come on now. No, get thee beneath me. Her. What's the devil again? Y'all, that go to Ten of Wands. This guard your gates guard the gates of your eyes your ears your mind. guard your energy period right if you start feeling funny or you start feeling drained around certain people even if you spend the whole day alone and you start your day off beautifully and then by the end of the day you feeling like Fuck this world da, 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 da. take note of what when did your energy change you know what i'm saying that helps pinpoint you know what I'm saying? What throws our energy off? It could be as simple as a video that you watched, a song you heard, all the way to as complicated as your damn immediate family. Okay? Take heed to that because some this damn... You know the enemy use people now. Lower vibration. It's just like the angels use people. You know what I'm saying? We got to know that it's dark with the light type of shit. You know what I'm saying? And it does not want you to get to this nine of cups. Because you're going. Look now. You're going. You're going. Vroom. Vroom, vroom. And you're going to get there. Just as long as you don't let this devil slow your ass down. Okay? Because he going to try to. I'm telling you. Listen. <laughs> I don't know what that was about. <laughs> Tell that ninja that. Listen, ninja. Okay? Like, literally get thee beneath me. He wants to trap the hell out of you. Okay? Bless him, Lord. I thought Jesus got the keys and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, how he gonna... 
Get up out of here. Satan, you don't have no rain over here, bruh. You know what I'm saying? Like, your shit gone. It been gone. Get the fuck out of here now. Oh, Lord. What else Pisces need to know about this name? Devil spirit. A Capricorn could be significant. A Cancer. Another Pisces. Scorpio. Pisces. Cancer. Okay. Tell me about the devil. Like, this could even be temptation. This could be, let's say, you sitting down to write a book, right? And this is just a random... I feel like it's so hot. And this is just a random, you know, example. But you're sitting down to write a book, right? You, you start writing, and all of a sudden, oh, I'm hungry. You get up, you go get you something. You start back writing, oh, I'm thirsty. You get up, you go get you something to drink. You know what I'm saying? You sit down and start writing, oh, it's cold in here. You get up and you go... Me, it had been two hours, and you done got one sentence done. You know what I'm saying? Little shit like that, in my opinion, be, you know, like something to slow you the fuck down. Right? Now, I don't know how to get over something like that. But I'm sure you'll figure it out, Pisces. Uh, <laughs> I don't like your little ADHD uh, wrapped up in that shit, too. We ain't gonna blame everything on the devil. You know what I'm saying? Okay? <laughs> but you know the devil, real talk, the angel is like the high, you know, like your higher your higher, um, I don't want to say your higher self, but like your higher vibrations, right? And the devil's like your lower vibrations, right? This shit can be all internal. What is it? Is it internal spirit or is this some outside energy? Tell me what it is. Shit, it's the ace of cups and a towel. Tell me what the ace of cups is. The six of cups. What's the ace of cups, spirit? ten of pentacles this could even be family okay yes definitely it's gonna be different for everybody a scorpio could be very significant here somebody that passed over is helping you somebody that passed over is helping you an ancestor is helping you something's about to overflow for you and it's gonna happen so how does that happen spirit it's gonna happen like without expect <clears throat> not without expecting how do i say this unexpectedly you've been doing a really good job at balancing something though in your life you really have because i feel like a lot of shit has been thrown at you possibly uh, something could have possibly recently just happened that was kind of really heavy right but this, this look is giving me very much like you've dealt with some some loss you've dealt with some bullshit you've dealt with some sad ass times you know what i'm saying you've lost dolphins could be significant okay dinosaurs okay play-doh children sea world okay whales Something about Christmas toys, too. Somebody here could have lost a child. Okay. Oh, Lord. I'm like, what is that? That's my iPad. Okay. It's something about either somebody losing somebody that was like a child. Or you could have lost somebody significant when you were younger. Tomatoes could be significant. Somebody can have like a uh, either an affinity, like really, really like tomatoes or allergic to tomatoes. Okay. Or like somebody don't like ketchup or somebody might be like, I don't know. So you might have been a picky child. Pizza. Okay. Wafers, vanilla wafers. Where did she come from? <laughs> like, what are we talking about? <laughs> I'm just be obedient, okay? <laughs> I swear, sometimes I'm just like, should I even say that? Like, what is that? That doesn't make sense. But maybe it made sense for somebody. I don't know. <sighs> Tell 
Tell me more. What is this Ace of Cups that they... What is, what is this, Spirit? They go to Nine of Wands again. I'm telling you, when I say what I be saying, I be saying it. The Nine of Wands, the Queen of Wands, the Three of Swords. You've had to deal with a lot. You've had to deal with a lot. And you've dealt with people that then smiled in your face and stabbed you in your damn back. Golly. I, I just heard, when will this be over? Like, when when will this be over? It's his fault, y'all. <laughs> Whether this is in you or outside of you. It's this damn low-ass vibration. Right? And then the devil with the five of cups, y'all. Like, this is the devil. Like, this is... Oh, I, anyway, it's not about my beliefs, okay? But <laughs> the devil with the five of cups is giving me very much, like, low vibrations, right? I wish my car was still out here. But... Higher vibrations attract higher vibrational things. Lower vibrations attracts more lower vibrational things, okay? It's also something here about you uh, quitting an addiction or something, or you quit an addiction, and it's it's a message here like, stay the course, because you ever heard that story in the Bible, I don't know how it goes word for word, but it's like you get rid of one demon, and then you clean up your house and you let the demon back in. And he bring like seven of them hoes or something like that. Something like that. It's like, don't allow something to come back from the past because it's going to be like seven times worse. Okay. The number seven could be significant. Yeah, it's very much um, like something will be like, I just heard 10 times. Okay. And then the 10 of wands is here. Like some will be very, very hard to get rid of. All right. So just fair warning don't the we in mercury retrograde don't let something from your past something you either let go of you walked away from don't allow this to come back because it's going to slow you down because it's going to put you in a low vibrational energy right okay you got something here that you're working on and you're mastering this thing or you're going to become a master in this craft okay continue to work on that all right shit oh lord okay What's the Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, the Tower? Mm, the Seven of Pentacles. Tell me more, please. This is so interesting. The Tree of Life could be significant. All right. <clears throat> Ew. spirit what's what's this what's the just look the seven of pentacles right it represents reaping which so seven of pentacles also represents being patient right it can represent time things like that right you got the tempers <laughs> more patience jesus okay Lord, duh, duh, duh. we be any more patient, God. Shit might start going backwards now. Come on, yeah. You know. Why we gotta be patient? Why? why? <laughs> I'm that child, right? <laughs> why, mama? <laughs> why we gotta be patient, though? What's going on? What's all up with all the patience and stuff, spirit? It's the lack for me. <laughs> Oh, Lord, five of pentacles. Five of pentacles is very much lack. All right? That's not seeing the abundance right in front of you. That's feeling left out in the cold, right? When, and pick up will resonate, lead the rest. But if you're ever in the five of pentacles energy, you're going to perpetuate more five of pentacles energy, right? You wake up in the morning, you stump your toe. God damn it, mother. And that's the, the, it's not what happens to you that determines your karma. It is how you react to that shit that determines your karma. You understand what I'm saying? Right? That, that, what, that ain't your karma. What your, your response to that shit is your karma. You respond, and of course it's not easy. That was a bad example. Because who the hell would be happy about that Tobia stuff first thing in the water when you get out of bed? But it could cause that made me think of the secret, the movie. If y'all ain't seen it, check it out. They got it on YouTube for free right now. They don't always have it on YouTube. They be removing that whole sometime. But the secret, check it out, okay? Help you manifest your whole wildest dreams, okay? Anyway, though, 
but it's like that snowball effect right because like attracts like where your attention goes your energy flows so if your attention is on some five of pentacles type of shit some i'm left out in the cold it's five of cups which was crossing you okay and you got the five of wands out here that's a whole lot of fives five 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 could be uh significant or sim symbolic you've been hurt though you've been literally yo yo like People, places, things, situations you put trust in could have ultimately destroyed that trust with you. So I, I can understand the sentiment of the Five of Pentacles, but tell me more, Spirit. What's the Five of Pentacles, please? Why we got to be patient? What's lacking? The two of wands. We got to plan something in the Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so some, first of all, something can't be rushed. Something is going to need delicate love and care, right? I think the Queen of, Queen of Pentacles was out here earlier somewhere. Um, interesting. Y'all, you, you've attracted a lot of people who just wanted to use you for one reason or another. <laughs> it's some about it for my man y'all put the enjoy go pretty girl privilege right like people could think oh my god he or she is so this and they're so that oh my god they have everything that anybody could ever want and it's something about like people don't realize what you've been through they only see the beauty that you are the attractive guy that you are whatever you present to the world is odd they don't see that you have dealt with a lot of fucking bull crap. I'm going to just say that. But anyway, some sort of planning and properly doing something here, like properly preparing for something. Tell me, my spirit. Yeah, something needs to, it's a new perspective of something here, right? You're even going to find a way, like a new way. To, you, you're you about to find a new way to do something, to grow something, to increase something, to get to the next stage, the next level, the next phase, the next cycle, the next chapter in your life. You're about to figure it out. It's going to be some sort of new way, though. This is this, this, You're growing. Growing pains. That's what I just heard. So give us some advice, Spirit, please, for Pisces. Okay. Temperance. Patience. Balance. Right? Give me a minute. Of course, angelic assistance, right? And y'all know we have free will, right? Okay. So with free will, our angels, for the most part, can't intervene into things until we ask them to so make sure if you are feeling this or this or this make sure you talk to your folks like hey yo i need y'all's help like i need you to put a smile on my face help me get into a happy state or something real talk ask and you shall receive okay some about a foot wash too could be significant. Okay. Advice, please, for Pisces. They tell me. Okay, hematite. All right. Oh, justice. Come on now. A Libra could be significant. Self healing, grounding, right opportunities. Come on now, spirit. That's what some of this is about too. About you not acting too quickly on something. Like everything that glitters isn't gold type of shit. You know what I'm saying? A right opportunity. Because it's like right now you might be like this damn chariot car racing to the boat. And y'all weren't we talking about <laughs> your ships coming in and the devil ass trying to look. Try to stop your ships from coming in. I'm telling I'm telling you. Okay. 
bless him, Lord. Help him, Jesus. He ain't had enough. Go on, teach him another lesson. <laughs> Let me stop. Okay. But I saw the two of wands out there again. And there go that queen of pentacles again, right? So, it's something about a, a, a perfect opportunity or something. Or something like that, right? So, take your time, Pisces. And whatever this is for you, okay? Be consistent with whatever this is, all right? Even if the consistency is consistently being grateful, consistently praying, consistently talking to your spirit team, asking for guidance, okay? All right, so don't forget to like the video, my babe. Share your planets. Make sure your notifications are on, all right? 52, 20, I'm sorry, 25, 52 is on the clock, all right? So just be aware of what we put out. That shit come back to us, right? Okay, that mirror effect, all right? But anyway, Pisces, I love y'all so much. And I'll talk to y'all down below in the comment section or in the next video. Bye, Pisces.